Hi, this is Tracy. I'm Nuwasa's CAPC coordinator. I'm going to show you how you and your children can make stores for your children's toys. Okay? So you'll see what I have here is two that I've made up. And what I decided to call them were children's bookstore and a fresh lemonade store. Okay? And you'll see I have a couple minion toys here. Okay, so I'm just going to move those now. I'm going to show you what all I used. Actually, let me show you what I've made first. So let me start with the children's bookstore one. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Okay, so that's that one. <coughs> Excuse me, and then I put some Kleenex in there where the spout was. Okay, so the next one looks like this, and I decided to call it a fresh lemonade store because this one had lemons on it, so I decided to leave the lemons on it. So that's what that one looks like. Okay, so all I used was my milk and my lemonade containers. And so what I did was I cut out a hole in the front here. Well, actually, that would be the back because I used this boat as like a I guess like a fireplace so this is the front for me and I cut out holes here for the doors and then on the sides I cut out windows so for the children's bookstore I cut out one window on this side here okay and for the fresh lemonade store, I use these markings here. Let me show you as my guide for cutting out two windows. Okay, so let me move those aside now. And to cut those out, it may be a little tricky, so. I'm just gonna bring these back. Maybe a little tricky so the the adults will most likely have to cut that out. Can use a pair of scissors, but I used a utility knife. Okay. So move these aside again and I will show you what all I used. So I use those empty containers. I use some construction paper and some pages from children's books. And I use some felt and stickers. And I used white glue and I use a popsicle stick to spread out the glue on the pieces of paper and the felt okay and white glue will help it to stick better because if you use a glue stick it will most likely dry and then fall off so I recommend the white glue okay so I'm just going to move those aside. So I can show you again the ones that I have done. So this is the fresh lemonade store. So you'll see I just cut out the construction paper 
and I covered up all the writing on the box and I've left the pictures of the, the lemons because I decided this one was going to be a fresh lemonade store okay so I put Queenix in here at the back where the spell is so that'd be like a, a fireplace where the smoke's coming out of I put stickers on the roof here and I put I decided to leave the flap on mine and I put felt on here and also inside okay and so that's that one and then this one here the children's bookstore is I used the construction paper again for some parts and then I used pages from children's books there. Oh. some of the other parts okay and on this one here I did the same it just has no pictures on these sentences here okay and up here you'll see I used a page from my children's book as well from my roof up there and then I used the gem stickers okay and I put the felt here this one's like a sparkly felt and then felt inside okay and again I put the Queenix back and so now we have a children's bookstore and a let me zoom down a little bit closer and a fresh lemonade store. Okay, and I'm gonna put the minions back. Okay. That was super easy and super fun. Okay, thanks. Take care.